teaching you how I coded my website and honestly it's not that difficult especially if you have prior knowledge of coding specifically stuff like HTML some Java depends on like what you're gonna do on your site and CSS and if you know like those three things then you should be set and also if you're a beginner don't worry because I was also like a full on beginner do nothing about coding when I started my website so don't worry it is actually not too hard okay so let's get started um, so basically, I used this website, and it's called NeoCities. It should look like this when you first go to the landing page, and it's going to ask you to sign up. And basically what this site is, it's like, um, it's basically just like a hosting site where you can just host your own URL for free and it's really really nice um so yeah what you want to do is you first sign up for like your domain name and you know you put your information and you make a password and oh yeah also when you choose the url for your website make sure it's something that's like that you actually are sure about it like, make sure that you're actually sure about the name that you choose because you, while you can change your URL at any given point, um, it might affect traffic to your site because if you change the URL, then people will not, like, they won't be redirected to your new URL, so you should be careful about that. So yeah, um, once you sign up, you're gonna, you're probably gonna like your page after you sign up should look something like hold on my wi-fi is being a little slow but your profile should kind of look something like this it might be a little different because mine already has all of my stuff in it but you should have something similar to this as well and there's going to be like a little edit button oh yeah and the little directory to like go to everything is right here where your username is and if you click on that there's like a little drop down and it has a bunch of different options for different things you want to do like editing your site, visiting your site, looking at like your site profile, looking at traffic, activities, stuff like that. And so basically these two red buttons here you're going to want to click on edit and once you do that, it should redirect you to like basically behind the scenes of your website. And yours is probably going to look very different from mine because I have like a bunch of different pages and I have like images and stuff that I added in. So it's like, there's a lot going on, but yours probably won't look like this. And you'll probably only have like maybe like I think you have like a picture of like the Neo Cities cat maybe and then like your main index page and that's just gonna be blank with like the Neo Cities logo and some coding tips. And so basically if you hover over like that index page, it'll have like a couple options I think. I think the first one should be edit if you hover over the little the little like rectangle. And once you click on edit, I'm just gonna click edit for a random page, it should take you to like basically all the code that's in your website, and for me I have like a lot of stuff, okay well not for this page specifically, but I do have a lot of stuff going on, and yours again probably won't look like this, it'll be a lot simpler, and this is basically where you start, and oh yeah, tip is you should probably make a style sheet and for people that don't know what I'm talking about it's basically like um you make like your own formatting which I also had to do which took very very long and I can show you 
because once if you like have like the style sheet done you basically already have all of like the groundwork to your site done basically but this is also like the most time consuming and the most hard part so yeah let me let me show you what my style sheet looks like so basically it's just like the groundwork for your website so for me I have like different fonts like different text boxes you know like different decorations that I like different image backgrounds like everything is in here which is why it is really really long it is very very long and yeah this this was literally the death of me like this this was very stressful and you don't have to do this honestly i've seen people who don't make like a style sheet and they just include like everything just in the beginning like in their index like on their index page they have like everything just on the top first and honestly you could do that but i would recommend making like a separate thing for it because it's just easier and it's more organized and you don't have to like copy and paste all of that code into other pages because it won't transfer over so yeah and what else so that's like the bare like minimum i guess that you should know and okay like like i said this the way that you code is using HTML, so honestly, like me having zero coding knowledge when I first started my website, HTML was actually quite easy to pick up for me at least. I don't know if that's like, I don't know if HTML is just like easy in general because like I said, I literally don't have any experience in coding other than just what I've been doing myself. So yeah, but in my opinion, HTML was quite easy to pick up. I think I picked it up within like a month or so. And yeah, um, what else? The thing, the great thing about this like website, like NeoCities is again, like you don't have to pay to have your own like little site domain thing up. And also, you can also look at other people's websites and get inspiration from them too because I got a lot of inspiration from a lot of different sites and I actually have them linked in my website because they're cool, you should definitely check them out. But yeah, there's a lot of like, there's a lot of different like types of websites, like different topics people talk about, the way it's like designed, it's so unique and I just, I really like just scrolling through and seeing what other people are up to because it's really fun. But yeah, and oh yeah, if you decide to make a website using this, you should comment it and then I'll go take a look at it because <laughs> I don't know anyone else who has a NeoCities website. Like, I, I'm the only one. Like, I mean, like, of course there's other people, but, like, I haven't met anyone that's coded on NeoCities before, so... Yeah. But I think that's basically all I wanted to talk about, because, um, for the rest of this, um, it, like, the site itself kind of walks you through everything, so it shouldn't be that hard but yeah I just really wanted to share this because lots of people have been asking and yeah I thought why not and also this is a really good excuse to pull out my my lean cosplay because I don't know I have no other reason to be wearing stuff like this right now but yeah I hope this helped you. I, my website is like basically a year's worth of work. Yeah, it did, it took a very long time and I was very, very focused on it for a long time. Like I would stay up until maybe like four or 5 a.m. just coding and trying to get like one line of code to work perfectly because Oh yeah, the special thing about my website is that 
it looks the same on both like desktop you know phone like it looks the same everywhere and that took so so long to figure out because yeah not having any prior knowledge of coding it was really rough it was it was really rough but yeah i honestly had so much fun learning though i love learning stuff on my own because then i can go at my own pace and i can learn whatever i want so yeah i don't know for coding in particular i did have a lot of fun so if you want to make your own website or you just want to get into coding or you just want to do some stuff for fun i recommend what i just showed you today and i hope this answered a lot of people's questions and i'll leave like the link to the website in the description so if you want to like make your own website it'll just be right there and yeah thank you for listening to me blabber about stuff i like um yeah i hope you have a good day, a good night, a good whatever. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry, I don't know what to say now, but... Yeah, I hope this helped you. And I need to go to sleep because it is very late. <laughs>